at the 20 yard line. That's going to bring up fourth down. Fourth and 20 for the Knights. Knights come to the line. Need a big play here for the Knights. Trojans looking for a defensive stop here. A lot of sideline instructions coming from the Knights coaches. Takes a snap. It's a high snap out of the shotgun again. He's got to go get it. And he makes the pass, but that is not going to be good for our first down. First down for the Trojans. First down for the Trojans. They have an excellent field position against the Knights. They lead 14 to six. With time running out here in the fourth quarter. Under center, pro set, takes a snap. Keeps it, and he'll get taken down. Loss of about three, maybe four yards on the play. It'll bring up second down. Second and about 13 for the Trojans. Knights needing a defensive stop here. Takes a snap, hands it off, comes here to the near side. Looks to cut up. Now he's going to get wrapped up and a great stop that time by the Knights. Number one, their own, the correction, Brendan Logan on the stop. And a timeout is called by the Knights trying to preserve some time here in the fourth quarter. 14 to 6 is our score. Third down and long coming up for the Trojans. Keep it here. We'll be back here on Typer Radio. Game Breaker, powered by D3O Impact Protection. Game Breaker headgear is available in 11 different color options, all of which can be completely customized with heat transferred logos made on demand in San Antonio, Texas. Game Breaker is a proud sponsor of the Typha Safety Initiative and sponsor of the Typha Radio Player of the Game Award. Make Game Breaker a part of your team's efforts to ensure safe play. Go to GameBreaker.com or call Daniel Moreno at 210-373-7840. Check them out and order yours today. Game Breaker. Protect the player. Protect the game. Third down and long for the Trojans. They lead 14 to six. Knights needing a defensive stop and get the ball back. Try to get back in this football game. Takes the snap out of the shotgun. Looking to turn the corner on the far side. He'll lower the shoulder, number five on the carry. And he'll get just beyond the original line of scrimmage. Right about the 20 yard line, it's gonna bring up fourth down. Fourth and about eight coming up for the Trojans. Shotgun, strong side to the right are the Trojans. He'll go to that right side, looking for some blocking, tries to lower the shoulder, and he will not get the first down. Turnover on downs for the Knights.
Not sure how much time is left in the game. Thank you. Minute 45 remaining in the football game. Knights with the ball at their own, tw their own 15 yard line. Shotgun, split backs in and they put someone deep. Casey goes over and it does. And he's got to, he still loses the ball. It's still loose. And it'll be recovered by the Knights, but at their own one yard line. Again, why do you go to a, a shotgun when it's not working for you? Deep, deep, deep. One yard line. You asked for it, you got it. Unbelievable. Guess what they're going to be working on in practice this week? Backed up to their own one. Knight, second down and long. Under center. Takes the snap. Looking to pass. He'll set it up. It's caught. He'll come here to the near side. Fights his way up to about the 10-yard line. They'll spot him probably about the 9. That's going to bring up third down and another timeout, I believe it's called. This one called by the Knights. And if I'm correct, that should be their third and final timeout. Waiting for the official signal on that. Well, that looked like you were swatting a fly, but I guess that was the three timeouts. Third and final timeout by the Harker Heights Knights. They're backed up to their own 10-yard line. Third down, they've got to get all the way to about the 25 for a first, as we're going to stay right here. Under center, takes the snap. Again, looking to pass. He'll send it up on the far side and too far in front of his intended receiver. Pass intended for number 11, Corey McMillan. That's going to bring up fourth down. Knights ranked number 20 here in Division I rookies with a regular two and three. Looking to go to 500 at three and three. Here's the snap, under center, looking to pass again. In trouble, and he's gonna get sacked. And the Trojans will take over at the four yard line. And that's the ball game. Final score, 14 for the Colleen Trojans, six for the Harker Heights Knights. The Knights will drop to two and four on the season with an outside chance of getting on the bubble for the playoffs. Keep it here, we'll be back for the start of the junior game. Time for radio player of the game. It's gonna be number 12, Ty Tyreek Wade for the Trojans. Thank you for joining us, we'll be back. <laughs> 